The wife of St. Lucia's Governor General Lady Julita Snack commemorated the occasion with commendation for the women who put their lives on the line to ensure the safety of all during the COVID-19 pandemic. She noted too that while many strides have been made in achieving equality, there is much to be done. More and more women are rising to positions of leadership in both the public and private sectors, breaking down barriers and achieving high levels of excellence. There are now more women in our parliament than ever before, although still not enough. On the downside, there are growing problems that have to be addressed. Women still face discrimination in the workplace and are targets of sexual harassment and abuse, again in the workplace. We are reminded ever so often that incidents of domestic violence targeted at women are still widespread. Government departments charged with the responsibility of looking after women's affairs are unable to adequately cope with the workload because they are understaffed and underfinanced. A little over a year ago, before the pandemic, St. Lucia hosted an international forum. The aim of the organizations was to ensure that domestic laws and policies to combat violence against women have impact in the home at work and in the community, and are within the grasp of every woman, no matter her race, ethnic origin, economic status, or educational background. The COVID-19 pandemic has placed additional burdens on women the world over, including the loss of livelihoods and having to supervise children at home with the closure of schools. Lady Julita explains that it is in times like these that women should band together, providing support to one another. All this speaks to the need in our country for a vibrant women's organization or movement to continue to advocate to keep issues involving and impacting women on the front burner. It is also imperative that women remain focused and vigilant, lest the, grain, the gains that we have fought hard for over so many years for justice, respect and equality begin to be eroded. Women everywhere want and should have a future free from stigma, stereotypes and violence. A future that's sustainable, peaceful, with equal rights and opportunities for all. To achieve that agenda, women need to be present wherever decisions are being made. We cannot be passive or show disinterest. Lady Julita Snack.